Anemia is a condition that develops when your blood lacks healthy red blood cells, also called hemoglobin. There are over 400 types of anemia. Certain types of anemia can be caused by blood loss. The blood loss can be from a traumatic event with an open external wound or a puncture of an internal organ. Blood loss anemia can be due to gastrointestinal issues such as a gastric ulcer, gastritis with bleeding or hemorrhoids. Cancer can be the cause of blood loss anemia. Some patients have significant blood loss during a surgical procedure which can lead to post-operative blood loss anemia. Excessive menstruation can also cause acute blood loss anemia. Anemia can be due to red blood cell disorders and not due to blood loss. Common tests for anemia are complete blood count, which helps the clinician determine the number and size of hemoglobin and the content of the red blood cells. Iron and ferritin levels are tested to test for total stores of iron. Vitamin B12 and folate levels are measured due to the fact they are necessary for blood cell production. Reticulocyte counts and bilirubin tests can be performed to determine the speed of blood cell production. A colonoscopy or EGD can be performed to assist in determining the source of the unknown bleed. Treatments for anemia are blood transfusion, iron supplements, vitamin B12 therapy, folate supplements, and hormone treatment to stimulate red blood cell production. ICD-10 has multiple categories of anemia that can be queried. Following is a list of the most common code descriptions. Deficiency anemias, due to decrease of red blood cells or hemoglobin. Deficiency anemia, dietary folate. This anemia is due to lack of folate or folic acid. It can be due to lack of folate in the patient's diet, alcoholism, and medications. Iron deficiency anemia, due to chronic blood loss. This anemia can be due to bleeding from a range of sources, which leads to low iron. Deficiency anemia, vitamin B12, due to intrinsic factor deficiency. This anemia is due to a lack of substance in the body called intrinsic factor. Intrinsic factor is a protein secreted by the stomach which joins B12. Without intrinsic factor, your body cannot absorb vitamin G12. Refractory anemias. The following anemia types are also referred to as myelodysplastic syndrome. Refractory anemia with excessive blasts. The abbreviation for this condition is RAEB1. There is an increase in myoblasts in the patient's bone marrow or blood. Refractory anemia with excess blast 2. The abbreviation for this condition is RAEB2. There is an increase in myoblasts in the patient's blood. Refractory anemia with ring sideroblasts. The abbreviation for this condition is RARS. There is a presence of ring sideroblasts in the patient's bone marrow. Hemolytic anemias due to red blood cell destruction. Hemolytic anemia due to hemolysis, which is a breakdown of red blood cells. Hemolytic anemia, mechanical. Anemia due to hemolysis. Causes can include prior treatment with a heart and lung bypass, history of an artificial heart valve, malignant hypertension. Anemias due to other conditions. Anemia due to chemotherapy. Chemotherapy drugs attack cells that aid in the formation of red blood cells. Anemia due to acute blood loss. Traumatic injuries, gastrointestinal issues, or other factors deplete the body of blood. Anemia due to chronic kidney disease. Diseased kidneys are not able to produce regular amounts of erythropoietin. Erythropoietin is required by the body to produce red blood cells. A plastic anemia is a rare type of anemia where bone marrow and stem cells are damaged. There is a deficiency in all three blood cell types, red blood cells, white blood cells, and platelets. Aplastic anemia, congenital, Fanconi's anemia. There is a deficiency in all three blood cell types, red blood cells, white blood cells, and platelets. A rare congenital anemia characterized by physical abnormalities and bone marrow failure. A plastic anemia due to radiation and or chemotherapy. There is a deficiency in all three blood cell types, red blood cells, white blood cells, and platelets. Neoplastic drug and radiation therapies not only kill cancer cells, but they kill or damage healthy cells, including cells in the bone marrow. Common clinical indicators of anemia include chronic kidney disease, alcohol abuse, gastrointestinal hemorrhage, history of chemotherapy, history of radiation, 
malignancies, nutrition deficiency, hypertension, recent surgeries, recent trauma with blood loss, hemorrhoids, excessive menstruation, iron deficiency, folate deficiency, B12 deficiency, and anorexia or bulimia. Common diagnostic tests for anemia include bone marrow biopsy, hemoglobin lab test, hematocrit lab test, platelet lab test, white blood cell lab test, ferritin lab test, folate lab test, an EGD, colonoscopy, vitamin B12 lab test, reticulocyte lab test, serum iron lab test, a urinalysis, transferrin lab test, or a bilirubin lab test. Common therapeutic and treatments of anemia include blood transfusion, folic acid therapy, iron supplementation, vitamin B12 therapy, folate therapy, hormone treatment, control of the bleed causing the blood loss, or a bone marrow transplant. Possible query options for anemia include deficiency anemia, dietary folate anemia, deficiency anemia, iron deficiency due to chronic blood loss, deficiency anemia, vitamin B12 due to intrinsic factor deficiency, refractory anemia with excess FLAS1, refractory anemia with excess FLAS2, refractory anemia with ring sideroblasts, hemolytic anemia, hemolytic anemia mechanical, anemia due to chemotherapy, anemia due to acute blood loss, anemia due to chronic kidney disease, aplastic anemia, aplastic anemia congenital Fanconi's anemia, aplastic anemia due to radiation and or chemotherapy.